Okay, so this next stitch is the back stitch. And this is, oh, I don't know. It's like the show is open, it is running, and an actor has ripped a huge seam and you don't have time to run up to the costume shop or run downstairs to where your sewing machine is. So you're gonna do a quick back stitch, which is much more secure stitching. It's very similar to the basting stitch with the exception of one thing. So the first thing you're gonna do, again, moving right to left if you're right-handed, left to right if you're right-handed, if you're left-handed, but the needle is going to always be moving in the same direction that you're um, moving in. You're gonna take a short stitch and then you're gonna, oh yes, you should knot it at the end for sure. So you're gonna be moving back and forth and back and forth. You're going to put the, needle in about halfway back in the other direction where you came from and then push the needle in and then the needle is going to go past where your previous stitch came out and continue on. Okay, so on this side, it looks like one short stitch space and then a piece of thread coming out. On this side, it looks like one long stitch. Then you're gonna go back again to where you just were, putting the needle as close as you can to that previous uh, exit point, the previous place where the needle came out. Again, put the needle through all the way past where you just were, that's what it looks like on that side, and then pull it through. Needle in at that same hole, past where you were, pull it tight. And what you're gonna see, if I do this right, uh -huh, is that the, the stitch looks almost like a sewing machine stitch in that you see each individual stitch um, and they're butt up next to each other, end to end, like, on a, like in a sewing machine stitch. But, oops, sometimes things get caught. On the back, it almost looks like a drunken stitch. It looks like a little wobble back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, because they're really overlapping. And you can just continue on. Oh, oh, can you see? Sorry, strange angle. Don't rush this because it starts to get very sloppy if you do. You want to take your time on this one. And you will most definitely make a knot at the end of the sample. 